This is Johann Strauss. Uh, this is the Champagne Polka. Um, this is where we show off that these amplifiers actually have a lot of power. The last few things we played, if you were paying attention up front, we were only using about three or four watts. Um, this is where we're going to push somewhere north of 1900. Uh, uh, an additional 5 dB. Uh, in the case of the P10, 
the noise floor is below that of the phono cartridge or a 6 ohm resistor, which is pretty impressive with the uh, three stage gate structure. Um, it's a pretty amazing piece. It is, like everything in the tin series, based on a two uh, chassis design. So you have the phono stage, and then you have the power supply off to the side, and it can be expanded to dual mono or full core box. If you have more than four inputs, you can also double up the inputs and have a total of eight. Um, only in the dual mono mode, um, of course, at that point. So with that, I think we're ready to go, yes? Is Joe Baez ready to go? Great. So the P10. Thank you. 
similar to the Cannonball album, there is no good place to stop. So we're just going to choose this spot. We have one last piece we want to play for you before we turn this uh, over. We're going to play a, a choral piece of music that will also show off a little bit of the integration of the subwoofers and the advantage of using the same amplification for main arrays as well as the sons. Many of us choose analog because it is the most convenient of all the, of all our formats. And being funny, trying to be funny. Kevin, have you told us today? How is the connection with the antenna? Thank you. Have you told us? I did. Um, I did go through, but um, ask again. So I'm I'm happy to bring that up. Each amplifier is a dual channel amplifier, and we're running um, off of each rail the. Not so sonic, sorry, Thor's hammers and the XVX. Um, one of the unique features of all CH amplifiers is the ability to control uh, damping. We do it through global feedback. Um, and when we're in this kind of configuration, unlike a stereo amp where we have to use the same value for both, we're actually able to custom dial this in. So I'm using 1% global feedback on the main array and using 2% global feedback on the subwoofers, so I'm offering a little bit tighter control of the woofers by doing that. Okay. 
watch for right on time. <laughs> Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed the quick presentation. And now we have Koshio to help with the uh, Yuki. Thank you. My name is uh, Jun Nagamatsu. I'm a designer and the president of Yuki uh, Semitsu. And uh, uh, I designed, we designed this AP01. Okay. Uh, uh, I'm sure you don't know the Yuki company in the audio industry, but we established in 1950, so it's been a very old company. And uh, in audio, it's been about uh, two and a half, three years experience. And this is actually second product. Uh, first product AP0 and second product AP01. So this is AP01. Now it's a really uh, brain and uh, you know uh, from the whole of uh, Hong Kong and Chinese and China and Asia. So first, uh, before we talk more, uh, we play the, the one song. Here is a song we're gonna play, Sarina Jones. This is a very old record, I think. 1975. So it's kind of very old record, but the Sarina Jones, probably you know, I guess her name, and she's pretty good. I'll be 
be happy just to spend my life waiting at your beck and call. Everything I have is yours, my life, my own. Well, uh, this uh, timetable, which you can you see that it's very uh, unusual look. Uh, normal timetable has a big acrylic timetable with big feet and everything. But this was designed from scratch. We designed from zero. We didn't learn anything from that uh, old school. So we just you know, concentrate and made what should be best sounding timetable. This is Camus Discount. あの、見た目の良さではなくて、全て設計の理由というものがあります。例えばその、え、プラスターなんですけど、4キログラムありますけど、これは、え、浮いているフローティングの、え、プラスターということなんですけど、え、このプラスターと自分のシャフトの下
uh, like I said, uh, the old paths have reason to behind to make good sounding. For instance, platter here, this has four kilograms. It's not so heavy, but this platter is floating. Not by air, but magnetic, magnetically so, by magnet. So this spindle shaft, this one point here, is obviously uh, attached to the uh, bearing, but other, this spinning as like a spinning top. So all top, I mean, upper side and bottom side, magnetic is, you know, uh, supporting the spin, this Chicago 電池を貼るみたいな。to have a you know a shaft spindle and uh, uh, touch with the belly because if it's floating totally floating it's not stable so there are many uh, air <coughs> air uh, what you call air floating tantalum but the air floating is not touching anywhere so it's not you know such a stable actually so this was this is designed by to you know uh, uh, support it by one point belly and, uh, and also uh, 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 also the uh, static, <laughs> static is, you know, uh, from this static, is comes through this here to the ground. So it's electrically also, you know, visible. <laughs> 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 會產生靜電。當你浮起到一定的靜電,就永遠不會帶走,就在那裡不斷地靜電,一路波呢,靜電不斷地升降,令你的那個音樂就很遠遠出。所以那些電呢,我哋電住,那個機身,機身在地道
Face of this heart inside The postage is my soul Contains a message for millions Say keep don't go Ten thousand guitars waiting But it ain't quite the same You got a knack for saying Keep on going.
Ministry of Blood, Keystone Book, Saliva Coast. Uh, this tablet of Epidron also comes with Tona. Uh, so when you buy Epidron, it's Tona is ready there. So you just need the cartridge to print. Uh, this Tona is also made, certainly made by uh, Yuki, the design team. And uh, this is a very simple, good, simple, straight Tona. Straight Tona. But actually, that, uh, you know, very complicated uh, mechanism and function is included. Uh, Well, this pillar, four pillars, but you can see this pillar here. You can see, uh, you cannot see inside, but inside has so-called hysteresis plate, which is magnetic plate. And uh, uh, when you are, you know, uh, when I play, when we play that, you know, other player, here's a stylus. And they know uh, this is uh, this is a you know, cartridge, and this is toner. And uh, you know, uh, following the groove, uh, stylus move like this. But if the toner move together, then that you know, uh, you never know which sound is you are listening. So uh, this hysteresis plate, the magnetic plate inside, uh, try to prevent this too much movement inside. And this is hot. You so this is the only case you for you. No, no other company. Very unique. Uh, this is a DC motor, and uh, this uh, here, here is a pulley, and this uh, is not a belt drive, actually this is spring, Kevlar spring uh, drive, and the other side also has a, you know, a kind of pulley, and uh, this moves together. When you move this side, and this goes, see, like this, so that, you know, same tension is applied to the turntable. If it's only one belt, then that, you know, obviously belt stretch or belt attention goes only one side, but this has controlled by both sides. So, uh, 
uh, equal amount of the, the pension is you know applied to the district. <laughs> 如果你如果一個比較交大的大同的盤子就是要特別一邊的組成車 you probably say, what is this? What kind of ring is that? This is we call lean stabilizer. And uh, this, when you put this, this is a, <coughs> this is about a two kilogram. And uh, when you put this, if it's weighing this, maybe they can also make spark by this. And uh, this is a design, obviously, uh, mill. This, you know, uh, here is up to fit to corner of the platter. Very precision, mechanically uh, precision, and uh, mill by it. So this is can only use for focus AD01. Okay, last song, what we will play is here. Eva Cassidy. Uh, this is uh, probably you know that Eva Cassidy is she uh, passed away by skin cancer quite a long time ago, but uh, she's a very good singer. And uh, we're gonna play up. Uh, which place? Which trust you? We're gonna play field of gold, but this is 45 out here. That's size.
Thank you very much. 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 Th